Hey guys, my name is Jay and in this video I want to show you something very important that you need to understand when you're coding your CSS. All right, here we have a very simple HTML and CSS and you can see that I created um, like four divs uh, and this is a wrapper and then inside that wrapper is a row and then a column, then a container, then we have some text. And in the CSS we have the class of container repeat it all over again three times and you can see that the only thing that we're changing is the background color now we have here that important that we hate and we love at the same time but i personally don't like it because it causes a lot of issues in the, uh, when you are kind of working in a team or with other people so i'm going to remove it for now and you can see that it changed to the orange background which is this one and why? Because this is the last one and because it's the last one is the most the most important. So I'm going to just copy and paste it, put it right here and we can change it to black, let's say, for example. And you can see that it changed because it's the last one. So the first is the less important and the last one is the most important. OK, I'm going to remove that one. And um, now what I want to do is I want to override this one, right? I want to override this one, let's say, by this purple background. So we have here in the HTML, we have a wrapper, a row, column, and then the container. So I am going to be more specific and I'm going to add the column. So dot column. And now you can see that we override it, the orange background, even that is the last one. Now I am being more specific. So now this one is the most important. All right. I'm going to go to the first one and I'm going to be more specific. I'm going to add the row. So I'm going to go dot row dot column. And now you can see that we have a gray background, even that this is the first the first one in our CSS, which is the less important, but now is the most important because I, I am more specific, right? Now we can go here and something very important that people don't know is that the ID is actually even more specific. I'm going to go here. I'm going to add the ID of wrapper and look at this now is orange, right? So just because adding the ID now is more important than everything here. Now, if I add the ID here, of course, it's going to overwrite everything. And now this is the one that is super mega specific. Like we have the wrapper, then we have a row, then, in, then column, then the container, and now we have it. So now this one is actually the most specific that we can be right now, but I can even go here. Let's remove this and I can go and add important and boom, I override it everything. And that's the problem with important. So right now, let's say that you have, you're working with your own file and this important is in some CSS file that you don't know even how to find or is difficult to find and it's making your life a nightmare, right? So if I add important to this one, which is even more specific, then I overwrite everything because we have this that is extremely specific plus the important. Now we overwrite it everything, but you can see that now is becoming this headache code about overriding and overriding and overriding, which I don't personally like. So I hope you learned something new. This is very important to me. I want to share it. So that's it. Subscribe if you want to keep learning and click on the bell icon to receive notifications every time I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a beautiful day. Bye bye.